Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, let's learn how to write a Python program to list all the factorial numbers less than or equals to an input number n. So given the user input that is n, so let's take a value. So n so you have to find the factorial numbers less than or equals to n. So this is the problem statement. So let's take the n equals to something like 150. This is the sample user input I am taking. And now you have to find the factorial numbers less than or equals to 150. So let's take a numbers that is from 0 to 6 let's take 0 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 i'll tell you why i am taking these numbers so now let's try to find the factorial of these numbers 0 factorial is 1 1 factorial is 1 2 factorial is 2 3 factorial is 6, 4 factorial is 24, 5 factorial is 120 and 7 factorial is 720. So now if you try to compare these values that is 1 to 120, so these are less than the 150 and if you check the 720, so it is greater than the 150, so you should stop here. So you have to print only the factorial numbers less than or equals to n. So yeah, so let's take these two variables that is uh, counter and uh, yeah, so let's take this variable as factorial. Yeah, let's take factorial a variable and uh, counter. Let's try to keep incrementing and uh, let's try to keep calculating the factorial and keep comparing the factorial with the n using a while loop. So this is the problem statement and how you can solve this. So let's start coding. So now let me take a variable n equals to. So let's use input function call. And here I'll ask a user to enter a number yeah so once the user enters a number so let's convert it into int using a type conversion so once the user enters a number so let's take two variables that is uh, counter as i said earlier counter equals to one and uh, factorial factorial equals to 1. So now let's compare if uh, factorial is less than n using a while loop while factorial is less than or equals to. So this is the same thing what I am doing here. So less than or equals to the value of n. So now what you have to do is if it is less than the n you just print the factorial and give some space and equals to space yeah so and what you have to do is you have to calculate the next factorial so let's try to find the next factorial so factorial equals to factorial multiplied by the counter so that is a 0 1 2 3 that is a counter and also you have to increment the counter so let's increment it counter equals to counter plus one yeah so this is a complete program to find the factorial numbers less than or equals to an input number n so now let's execute this and let's see how it works enter a number so let's give 150 so you can see that numbers factorial numbers less than or equals to 
150 is 1 that is 0 factorial, 1 factorial, 2 factorial, 3 factorial, 4 and 5 factorial. 5 factorial is 120 and 6 factorial is 720. So 720 is not printing. So now let's give 720 and let's see how it works. Running the program again. Let's give 720. So you can see that 720 gets printed. So we are considering equals to over here. Now let's give 10,000 and see how it works. Yeah, you can see that this is the factorials that are less than 10,000. Yeah, so this is the complete program to find factorial numbers less than or equals to an input number n. That's it in this video. Hope you liked it. Thank you for watching. Bye.